What is going on, guys? Wisco Cisco coming at you with a little Dave Infamy action. We are playing Saint Low Liberation. This game just got underway. It's still like zero to zero on the the games, and then four ninety to five sixty. So we're a little late to the party. That was more of a alt tabbing issue, as I'm sure many of you guys are aware. In Dave Infamy has an alt tab issue, and yes, I know I can run it in windowed mode, but I don't like that. I don't like that. Just not me. Just not Wisco Cisco. Man, I am all thrown off my game because I have no idea where guys are now. You know, you got that nice rhythm to the start of the game. You kind of can know where guys are, but not when you join late, man. Late to the party. Fashionably late, really. All right, let's get on. Let's get on point here. I feel so bad too because I was the one that <laughs> swayed the vote to get this picked, and then I was like, "Oh man, the stream's being so delayed. I might not even play this game." There we go. Come on, I gotta get this cap. Come on, baby. Go right to the leaderboard with this cap. Just about, at least. There we go, baby. There we go. Almost shot up. Really not that many people in this game. Come on. Come on. Yeah, I really don't want to sit here too long. I think there's still that one more over there. Oh, there's definitely that guy right in front of me. Damn. Yeah, I don't want to sit there too long. You start to get... Be a sitting duck, and they start to know where you are. Uh, four and one, one cap on Charlie, and then one twenty on the score. Getting beat by low pan here. Two caps already for him. He got that early, that early cap on Abel. Man, puts you over the top. Always get that first cap on Abel. Also brought myself two smokes with me. Don't know that I'm gonna need them. I probably should have switched it up there. Uh, let's go with a Mark II. Yeah, I just need a Mark II. I actually did a recording for St. Lowe earlier today, and I was having some troubles. I My video drivers got all wonky. I tried to update. Insurgency Sandstorm, guys. Well, I was not, not even paying attention. Uh, Insurgency Sandstorm, guys. Man, it was screwing me over. I'm trying to get that game to work as, as best I can, and it is just not complying. I'm like, maybe I'll update my video drivers, and then I did that, and it screwed up my day of infamy like completely, and I couldn't revert back on Windows for some reason, and the whole thing's been a nightmare, basically. <laughs> So we finally got a game here, got it all working. I even started messing up with my recording software, and it's been it's kind of been kind of a rough little week here for streaming. But we're back to it, baby. All right, Germans just captured Baker. I don't know how that guy got the kill on me, but oh well. Still three to three waves. But yeah, I was doing a recording earlier, and then. For some reason, the, the bitrate quality was just terrible, and it was like all grainy, and I'm, it kind of sucked too, because it was a pretty good video, and I'm like, oh, that's a bummer. It was St. Low too. So, four hours later, here we are, folks. Back at her. God damn, I really got to start paying attention. I was like, looking at my map, I don't think we got that guy. You can always tell by the other guys, you know, they're kind of creeping around, being a little slow. It means I probably didn't get him. But we got enough guys there. I'll let my team dismantle, search and destroy that guy. I do want to get on point, but before I do that, I obviously want to check check my corners. I'm actually going to try and cheat and get up to this little spot here. Um, you can cap from here. So right now you can see that it's not capping, which means there's a German on. I'm going to guess he's over that sandbag right there. So I'm just going to pop, of course, pop it short. Who knows, maybe I'll get him. Yeah. I don't know where he's at. I'm, I'm thinking he's around here. Yeah, there's one too. It's just my guess. It's a good spot to be when you're the Germans. It's where I'd go, so sometimes you just got to think that way. That guy just got taken out from my right. There's an MG up there, but he got taken out from my right. So I have to kind of watch that. I'm not really going to go fishing. I mean, we got to cap this point. I just got to be ready for any German that's going to be in the area. I got a sniper watching me. Ever since I came on point, he's been back here. So I don't really need to worry about my left side. It's more just my right side at this point, and then that clearing. So looking at your map and knowing your surroundings, guys. I harp at every video, but it can save your life. Just little heads up play. It's not in the gunplay. It's all in the setup is really what it is. And I feel like most video games kind of boil down to that. It's all in your approach and your setup and kind of being smart more than the actual obvious play like gunplay. So hopefully we can 
get a cap. Yep, we did get a cap. I'm dipping out of there because they obviously know I'm here. There's an MG obviously to my right. I'm going to try and backdoor him. There's a... Oh, he had a Gewehr. That's such a bummer. Such a bummer. I had that guy dead to rights. And he missed his first shot, and I was like, good, perfect, golden. He's got a car, so I'm just going to swipe right around him. And he had that Gewehr, man. That semi-auto saved his life. So I'll switch this up to two Mark IIs now. On the loadouts. Uh, the bar, two Mark IIs, and the heavy kit. I really don't need the heavy kit, truthfully. I might get rid of that and do a sling. Uh, as far as the score goes, 7, 0, and 3. 3, 10 on the score and two caps. I might be able to sneak out an MVP, even though I'm late to the party. Fashionably late, baby. So we are at zero, zero waves on the bottom. Baker's contested right now, so we got to get it on it. At least the guy right here, man. Kilroy, you got to get on that, baby. Ooh, too late, man. That's the difference in the game right there. So the Germans get one wave because they captured Baker, the center point, in the streets. Now it's our turn to try and capture that. But how many times have I caught somebody in that alley? I've been so not paying attention either. <laughs> This is the third time now. I'm just, just not even paying attention. Looking at my map, talking. What up, dude? Easiest kill I'm gonna get all game. Gotta take it. Don't be cute. I see guys take out their knives and try and like knife them. And truthfully, the knifing mechanics in this game are really, 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 really bad. As I'm sure most of you guys know, you just miss. Like, there's just not a the hitbox registration is just off. And I mean, not only are you costing yourself a kill. Obviously, I heard that guy's gunshots. That's how I knew he was there. You're costing yourself a kill? I've... Oh, shit. I'm so screwed. That smoke helped me. So I'm just going to reverse course. I'm actually going to get up here and just get out of there. I have no idea where that guy is. I'm banged up. Yeah, he followed me. Nice. That's a bummer, too, with zero, 0 waves. I had to make a priority at Baker, and I didn't. That's the way it goes sometimes. All right, I got about 1,000 uh, loose sentences out there that I got to connect the dots at somehow, but... Oh, just to finish on the knifing mechanics. Yeah, I see guys knife all the time. And it's just not worth it, man. I mean, first off, you got to get a kill to the backside, which is hard enough. It usually registers, like, the side or the front. And then you're just they just turn around and shoot you anyway, so I don't even know why you try it. All right, failed engagement in the first one. That's all right. Uh, props to Lopan on that most valuable player. Although, I gotta say, it's kind of an asterisk because I wasn't in the game the whole time. Uh, Wisco Cisco, most suppressions. I'm kidding, of course, Lopan. Nice nice job with 10 kills. So, two caps for myself. I went 10 kills, four deaths, and 340 on the score. Certainly a respectable game. All right, let's get the bipod. Really max out your loadouts. That's what cap capturing points are for. Man, a radio. I will tell you, officer and radio on this is not... It's not usually used that often. It's kind of a it's kind of a tough map to bomb. There's so many things inside and indoors, and uh, it's not really a linear map. You know, there's there's all these like little jogs. So to even get artillery down is very easy to avoid. Carpet bomb, same thing. Uh, Stukas are really the thing you got to kind of worry about, just because you you might be in the wrong house. All right, since it is liberation, I'm gonna get on Abel here and get my points. That's what always gets you to the top. Get that MVP for doing it. So. Just take a quick pit stop here. Take a pit stop in my words per minute, too. Good lord, I've been talking y'all's ear off. I've been trying to work in y'all. This is a side note for my life. I've been trying to work in y'all in a lot of situations, and I've realized like only Southerners know how to, how to actually properly fit it into a sentence, because us Northerners, man, we just sound like idiots. Like, all the time. I can't say y'all. I can't. I can't do it. I, it's just awkward, you know, the placement. I just don't have it naturally. It's just not a. It's not something I'm born with. Oh, we got a, such a duel there. What a nice little duel. I could hear the gunshot, so I was thinking, ah, something's up there. I just want to creep in this little hole. He actually got a shot on me, so I'm surprised I didn't get a kill. Must have just been a glancing blow. All right, let's start hustling butt here to Baker. Got to help that cap that point, guys. Number one priority. Check the corners. Didn't check the right corners. <laughs> oh, well. Uh, get back to those loadouts. I guess I can get a heavy kit, but I don't think it's going to give me an extra grenade. So 
I think I'm just going to go with the light kit. You can see this weight. So when I do the heavy kit, it makes me really heavy and it slows down my running. And the way I play, I want to be as fast and nimble as possible. Which is sometimes kind of hard to do with the bar because you're, you're already slow enough as is. Same with the flamethrower. So you want to make it as light as possible. So that heavy kit doesn't really do me anything. It gives me extra ammo. And I don't even think it gives me an extra grenade in this situation. So it's really not worth taking and weighing me down. Yeah, we're starting to get it in chat. Exactly right. Stop loafing around here, guys. We gotta get on point. I mean, I know every once in a while you get you get bad luck. I mean, I did. I died right next to point. It happens. But when you look at the map and you see five, six, seven guys around it, and no one's on it, I mean, we got we got problems here. You know. I'm still worried about this corner. I'd actually like to take this building to my right. Yeah, I'm gonna. I don't, I don't have anybody around me. That's my problem. If I get on Baker, I'm not going to have the teammates. So I just want to observe the surroundings real quick. Oh my god. I, I wanted to just drop down and headshot that guy. I could have just like stomped him into the ground and killed him. Oh well, can't take on three on one. Like I said, I, that's why I kind of didn't want to get down there. Because I knew I was heavily outnumbered. It is what it is. Aggressive got two Gs. Yeah, it definitely has two Gs. Whoops. Yeah, there we go. We got guys on it. Good, good. I'm not there yet, though. Pretty much taking the same route. Um, I actually want to cut up the middle. I want to get there as fast as possible. That left side's been really bad to me. I'm just running right down the middle of the street. I got. I give no fucks right now, baby. Nobody there. Getting back here. Get, oh, where in the hell was that guy? I feel like that guy just shot me through the wall, but he didn't. Weird. That's funny. I can run through the street <laughs> with no cover. Not even have a shot at me. Get into the camping corner and just get, like, blasted with a pistol. <laughs> uh, we don't really need to get B. I said Zero Wave's got to get B. Uh, it's not really necessary to get B. However, it would be very, very beneficial with that extra wave. That'll almost assure us the win. Obviously, we can kill them off, too, to win. But that's a little bit more tactic. Yeah, they just captured Baker. Yep. <laughs> All right, this is going to be in a little bit of an uphill battle now, folks. Um, I'm thinking about maybe going up here for a second or two. We can always get Baker back. I mean, it's really not the end of the world. Yeah, I got a rifleman up there in the attic. Oh, oh I saw that guy too. Damn it. I saw him, but that American kind of threw me off because he went up. So I got that gun ready. Obviously, you guys saw that, but just not in time. Bummer. There we go. We got guys capping. Oh, we did have guys capping. Got that Wisco Cisco. Jinx on him. Oh, this poor bastard's left alone. Man, I still didn't get that MVP up there. Or top of the leaderboard, rather. I might have gotten MVP this game. I doubt it, though. I played a pretty bad match. Um, What were the Americans? Yeah. Alexander, props to that, man. You got a couple of those. Most of Wisco Cisco. Yeah, that's what I said. All right, guys. I think that's the end of the game. I mean, it's, it wasn't a bad game. Wish we would have done a little bit better and gotten the W, but all around, St. Louis not bad. So 13 kills, 8 deaths, 3 caps, most on the team for that, so I'm proud of that. And then 520 on the score. Lopin, nice game. Alexander, nice game. Ooh, I'm out of breath, guys. With that, I hope you enjoyed it. I certainly did, and I will see you all on point.